what you need to know about telemarketing. Telemarketing involves selling, marketing, or providing information about a product or service, such as Herbalife Nutrition products or the Herbalife Nutrition opportunity by using a phone or fax. This includes landline calls, cell phone calls, text messages, auto-dialed calls, and pre-recorded messages. As an Herbalife Nutrition independent distributor, when you're making telemarketing calls, proceed with great care. Federal and state laws strictly regulate telemarketing, and Herbalife Nutrition's rules of conduct also contain important parameters around telemarketing. The primary federal laws are the Telemarketing Sales Rule, TSR, and Telephone Consumer Protection Act, TCPA, and many states also have their own telemarketing laws. These laws restrict telemarketers from, among other things, making unsolicited phone calls to people who sign up to be on the National Do Not Call Registry. An unsolicited call is when you call a prospective customer who doesn't have an existing relationship with you or who hasn't previously consented to being contacted by you. Before making an unsolicited call, you must consult the National Do Not Call Registry and your own Do Not Call list. If you call a person who doesn't wish to be called, there could be very large regulatory fines and other penalties or lawsuits. The key to compliance is to first, avoid calling people who don't want to be called, and second, honor requests to stop calling people. How to access the Do Not Call Registry People engaging in telemarketing must register to access the National Do Not Call Registry, identifying oneself and not Herbalife Nutrition as the seller or telemarketer. This national registry is for people who don't want to be contacted by any company. You must also maintain your own personal do not call list of those who have directly told you they do not want to be contacted. There are a few situations when you don't need to consult the do not call registry. We will discuss the three most relevant ones. Consumer initiates the call. The first exception is when the consumer initiates the call. For example, by reaching out to you and asking for information. Calls made by consumers in response to advertising, a catalog, or marketing sent to them in the mail are also considered to be initiated by the consumer. Established Business Relationship EBR. The second exception is when there is an established business relationship, a prior relationship between you and the person you are calling. When there is an established business relationship, people can be called regardless of whether they're on the Do Not Call registry. There is an established business relationship when someone purchases an Herbalife Nutrition product from you within the past 18 months, or when a person asks about product or services within the three months immediately preceding the telephone call. But if the relationship has been terminated or a person requests not to be contacted, then it can no longer count as an established business relationship. Prior Express Consent The third exception is when the consumer has previously consented to being contacted in writing or an email or another electronic equivalent that can be proven. When and how should calls be made? Calling hours the federal rules restrict calls to between 8 a.m. and 9 p.m., but many states have more restricted calling hours. Check your state laws before making telemarketing calls, but in most cases, these states have start times at 9 a.m. or 10 a.m. and ending times at 8 p.m. Some also bar calls on holidays or have more restricted weekend hours. Transparency when making a sales call to a consumer, you need to identify yourself as an Herbalife Nutrition independent distributor and explain that the purpose of the call is to sell Herbalife Nutrition products or talk about the Herbalife Nutrition opportunity. Every outbound call must transmit accurate caller ID information where the technology is available, including your phone number and name. Caller ID cannot be blocked. Unsolicited faxes. Distributors may send faxes only to recipients with whom you have an established business relationship and who have provided their prior express consent to receive faxes. Please consult Herbalife Nutrition's Rules of Conduct for more information about sending faxes. Auto Dialers and Pre-Recorded Messages You may not use auto dialers or pre-recorded or artificial voice messages in connection with an Herbalife Nutrition business, products, or opportunity. Accountability 
Keep good records. Under federal law, you must keep records of telemarketing activities for at least two years. These records include ads, telemarketing scripts, promotional materials, information about customers and what they purchased, and information about consent from the people you called. If you receive any notice from a governmental authority regarding your telemarketing activity, immediately stop telemarketing and promptly report it to Herbalife Nutrition. Respecting Privacy Listen to the consumer. Don't persist when the consumer isn't interested. Even if a consumer doesn't explicitly demand to be put on a do not call list, please be mindful of what the consumer wants. Avoid pestering consumers or being pushy even if there is an exception to the do not call registry or if a consumer isn't on the registry. If the consumer seems annoyed or upset, please politely disengage. Follow the rules when sharing Herbalife Nutrition's products and opportunity with the world. By following these privacy principles when telemarketing, we protect the brand for generations to come. If you have questions, contact the Privacy Department at privacy at You are the distributor difference.